guys, it's Mama J again. I'm here just to show off a few more albums that I have picked up that have arrived. Again, I only buy them when I get a really good deal on them. And if I have a list and if they're not on my list, then I usually will buy them to try to add them to the list. I usually want the vinyl to be in good condition so I can at least play the albums. The covers, I mean, I don't want them beat to butt, but you know, um, some usage and some normal wear I'm okay with. Again, so I picked up four more albums. Um, I like a wide variety of different types of music. So I picked up Barry Manilow, Greatest Hits. I have seen Barry Manilow in concert. I actually took my dad to see Barry Man Manilow. He is actually one of the last concerts we went to right before the pandemic hit and everything kind of stopped. I had went with my dad that New Year's, it was the New Year's Eve show, but I think it was the night before New Year's Eve that we went. But either way, it was a really good concert. Barry put on a great show. This is the inside of the cover. Has different songs, has a letter, a um, picture of Barry. If you pull out the sleeves, um, they do have different things on the side here about you know the songs that are on here, but there is no, see it's just a list of the songs. Oops, sorry. Uh, but it doesn't have the lyrics in there. Like I said, back in the day, you know, it was a score if you got the lyrics inside because that's the only way you were going to get them. But the album itself is in really good condition. It is a greatest hits album. So, you know, it has like Mandy. It has um, Ready to Take a Chance Again. Looks like we made it. Daybreak. It's a Miracle. Can't Smile Without You. Bandstand Boogie. Um... Jump Shout Boogie, I Write the Songs, This One's For You. I, I, you know, I'm sure there's a song out there that everybody enjoys by Barry Manilow. One of the other ones I picked up, another greatest hits I was able to pick up was Willie Nelson. And I picked up Willie Nelson's Greatest Hits. Also a double, opens up. Oh, has a big old picture of Willie on the inside. Um, you could tell there's something got here and it kind of stuck the two right there on the bottom and the top. But it is, you know, older for wear. It does have just the plain white covers over the album, so no lyrics. <laughs> but it's still Greatest Hits. It has um, Georgia on my mind. Heartaches of a Fool, Whiskey River, Uncloudy Day, Faded Love, Till I Gain Control Again. All kinds of Willie Nelson songs on here. I like Willie, um, but it, you always remember Toby Keith's advice, don't get high with Willie. All right, so one of the other ones I happened to pick up, and if you're a parrot head, you may know, I got Jimmy Buffett, Havana Daydreaming. This is an older Buffett album, as you can tell. It also opens up, has a really cool inside hair. Nice album, but it is only one disc. This side is nothing, okay? This side does open, it is just the clear plastic or paper one. No words, no anything like that, but. Get out, but it won't roll back in in there so uh really cool really cool i'm glad to add this one to my collection i don't believe i have a lot of buffett on album um, i know that we have a lot of buffett on cassette and cd because my parents are huge jimmy buffett fans i just don't believe i have a lot of buffett on album but this one is now in part of the collection and last but not least for this one, I got the Charlie Daniels Band, uh, Fire on the Mountain, which is really cool album here. Really cool back of the album. Okay, and um, opens up to some pictures here. So Charlie Daniels Band, this one, uh, long-haired country boy, 
Trudy, Georgia, feeling free. The South's going to do it. New York City, king size, rosewood bed, no place to go. Really cool. Added this to my collection. I like the Charlie Daniels band, you know. More so from the Urban Cowboy kind of thing, but I thought this would be really cool, and I really liked the way the album itself looked and wanted to put it in the collection. So again, that's four more albums that I have added to the collection. Let me know what you think of these four. Do you have any of these? Um, as for concerts, I believe on these ones, I've seen Barry Manilow. I have seen Willie Nelson in concert. I did see Jimmy Buffett when I was much younger. I can't even remember which tour, but I know that I went with my mother to see him. Um, my dad could not go, so I went in place of my dad because normally they would go together. So I've seen him in concert. I have not seen the Charlie Daniels band. So. But other than that, I think four great pickups. Let me know what you guys think. All right. And we'll see you in the next video. Don't forget, check out the Patreons. Uh -huh.